I think that there has been quite a bit of change, but sometimes it can feel a little bit like one step forward, two steps back. And it's a, con a continuous practice of working with our own communities and communities that we aren't yet a part of. And I think that that's one of the things that is challenging for us because we like an end, end point, but it's also important that the journey is what it's about. I've been talking about diversity for 30 years and it's time's up. I feel like it's time to, to, like, to really make demands of the industry, of each other, of bosses, managers, um, in positions of power, people who can you know, share that power, people who can make those sort of uh, decisions about funding and who gets developed and who doesn't get developed. There is no risk more worth taking. I'm so sick of people saying, oh, that's so risky, what if the person gets upset? No, you deliberately target people who are ready to make that jump and there are literally thousands out there across Australia waiting for this. And we fight against discrimination in art and in society every day. And we're tired. So maybe rather than people from a diverse background talking about how we think diversity needs to be unpacked, maybe instead it's time for the privileged to think about how they can tear their own systems down.